pam 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 Right. Would help if I actually turned on my controller first, wouldn't it? There we go. There. Much better. So, um, votes are in, and Taunt is going away, so I'm going to boot Annie out. Yes, I have a reason. Come on, game. I know, I slept the computer. There we go. So let's go take a look at Lorelei, shall we? She's currently level 19, which means she's the same level as Domino. Nice comparison there. Lorelei has very little MP, I'm noticing. But at the same time, she's stronger than Domino. Hmm. Lower defense, though, that's a problem. However, notice that she has a nice set of healing spells, plus also wind and defense. So defense is a spell that I haven't actually been able to gain yet. Um, it's boost from Shining Force 2. Uh, defense increases speed and defense. It's the same thing as what happens when you use the ring of defense. So I am going to head out. and go to Annie. So basically I'm going to drop off everything in Taunt's inventory. I don't actually know what the Ring of Revenge does. Let me go look that up really fast. Let's see. Ring of Revenge and Beyond the Beyond. What does it actually do? Well, theory is that it increases counterattack rate, but nothing provable. Well, that's not useful at all. Hi, Annie. Of course I want you back. However, um, I need you someplace else first. Specifically, I need you in Discipline Town. Because I'm pretty sure that's, yeah. Can I actually use this indoors? Nope. And yeah, cities count as indoors. I, I don't know why. Item, light orb, use Discipline Town. I'm not joking when I say I'm probably never going to use Samson again. Um, there's a good chance that I will actually use him just to make teleportation a little bit easier. I'll keep him in one area that I constantly want access to. Oops. I need to sell stuff first. Herp derp. I can hear my cats having fun. Which is impressive given that I'm wearing noise cancelling headphones. That's right, it's up and to the right, isn't it? Yep. See, Taunt is going to finance everything. By selling his equipment... Oh, no, not the light orb. Okay, I have to unequip things first. Got it. Basically, I am never going to use Taunt again. Right, I would actually have to buy different equipment, so forget that. So here is what I am going to do. Yes, I want you back. Taunt is going away. Taunt is going to go to... Hmm. 
to sleep. Am I missing places? Ha! Oh, right. I can only put one person at a spot at a time. Okay. Um, Taunt, you're going to go here, actually. Oh, that's right. Let's get ourselves a formation here, because this is probably not the formation I want to be in. So, for the time being, while everybody's leveling up, I'm going to be having both Lorelei and Domino in the back. Once they're all promoted and stuff, I'm actually going to throw them back into the front. Well, Lorelei back in the front. Domino's going to stay in the back forever. Um, Lorelei will probably take either Edwards or Annie's spot, depending on who has better stats at that time. And yes, I know that I can take Steiner and go places, but I'm intentionally trying to get into random battles here, so... Oh, that's right. I didn't get a chance to show you! So, you notice that Steiner's not in combat, right? Actually, he is. You see, Steiner is a summon now, and only McWedka can summon Steiner. Sure, you can attack. Oh, I forgot to actually pick up equipment for Lorelei. That is Steiner! Steiner is the most powerful attack spell in the game, and he's also one of the cheapest. McWedga is actually the most powerful mage in the game. SURPRISE! Had to do that at least once. Um, let me at least go back to Discipline Town really fast, and darn it. Just so I can double check on if they have anything that uh, Lorelai can use. Because that would be nice. I have next to no money, though. It just dawned on me. Because I spent all of my money on Angel of Greenness. Ah, it turns out they don't have anything for her anyway. Well, that means I don't need to spend money, at least. Um, come on, monitor. Thank you. My monitor blanks out every so often for some reason. I haven't quite figured out why. It comes back on its own, so it's not like I have to do anything. It's just weird. Like me. Uh, let's see. Set things. There we go. So, I'm actually going to be doing a lot of the optional content at this point. This is the point of the game where you can reach almost everywhere. Um, the only places you can't reach are that one area Steiner can't access. By the way, that's Quamdar. Um, so, oh, I actually need some healing. Oh, I should also mention that Lorelei has wind, just like Domino. So we're going to end up having a fairly large amount of wind element on our in our party, which is abnormal for me because I normally don't have any. Blink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. Forgot McWedka is super powerful right now. Uh, yeah. Promotion for McWedka adds a huge boost of power, mostly because he can equip that awesome sword that he found. I'm actually taking my ship back to leave, because that's the area that I know how to get to this first item. Or first thing that I want. So weird that Edward is doing so much damage. Okay, there's leave. I should probably double check my directions to make sure I'm not right, because this is one of the few things I don't know off the top of my head. The reason why I don't know off this off the top of my head is because the official guide never actually had it, so I did not know all of these years. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 relatively due south. 
and then continue south. There we go. Um, basically, the official guide was terrible, and it missed two very major things. This is one of them. Probably heal a little bit. Eh, that's okay. Frontline Annie can take everything. This is also the por portion of the game where Annie starts kicking rear ends and taking names, as it were. To south. Till I come across land that is covered in forest terrain. This is very well hidden, by the way. There's a reason why I'm actually consulting a guide for this. Don't mind me, random battles, la 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 la. Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to pick up a resistor. Or a resist crystal, I should say, because Lorelei is not taking half damage. And her ocarina cracks, as usual. Okay. From here, northeast. Until I reach a mountain range, sail from the tip of this mountain range. So let's get to the tip. Tip of the mountain range. Or around the tip of the mountain range, then sail to the southeast. They're between the mountain range you just passed and another one. Okay, I know where I'm at now. Ooh, killer frogs. Remember these? Hint, they're not strong. Given the 16 XP. We're actually, this is, um, right next to, uh, Marion, if I remember correctly. This is the hidden area. Because that makes sense. Yep, I don't believe there is anything in here, or there is. Yes, there's things in here. There is nothing in that pot! Hey look, it's an old dude! Woohoohoo! Over here! Here! Crazy old man. <coughs> there we go. Monitor, there we go. Apparently, he either moves really fast or teleports. I think it's teleporting. One can't be too cautious. But I'm apparently the one. I know Kung Fu. But there's always a spoon, let's be honest here. So, you actually meet Merlin here. Apparently, Merlin's 300 years old. So, Merlin teaches you a resurrection spell. This is not normally a spell in the game. So, I did not know this even existed until the last time I played through the game. Um, I'm going to be giving this to Annie. I know that's a little stereotypical, and I was thinking about giving it to Edward or Taunt. Um... The main reason why is this. Take a look at their MP. So Edward does have more MP. I mean... No, wait. No, he doesn't. Never mind. It's not even worth it that perspective. Um, so Annie has more MP, and also her spells typically cost less. So Annie is the logical choice. Lorelai doesn't have anywhere near as much MP. Which is unfortunate. Because otherwise I would totally teach this to Lorelai, because that would be awesome. I think that's actually... Yep. I am actually that low on inventory space right now. 
This is a problem. Uh, let's go ahead and drop the healing herb. Sorry, I thought I heard something. There we go. And let's make a like a leave and GTFO. Yes, I know what the actual origination of the phrase is. So yeah, that secret, I would have never stumbled upon that myself. So this is probably going to be the last time I actually talk to Samson, by the way, but I just need to get him someplace useful. And this is not someplace useful. You know where it is, though? It's everybody's favorite ruined castle! Yep. Uh, let's go ahead and teleport there. I totally hit where Taunt was at, didn't I? Nope! It is in alphabetical order. Hooray! Oops, that was the wrong way. I used to have this perfectly memorized where I did not even need to look at the screen while I went here. That is how often I had to travel here, mostly because it's the only place in the game that you can buy resurrection herbs. Which, in my mind, was the only way to resurrect somebody. Oh, I was wrong, but that's okay. All right. All right, I need to sell something first. Mostly so I have inventory space. Uh, I'll go ahead and sell a cure herb. Hopefully I have enough money to buy the uh, resist jewel. Resist jewel, yep. It only takes a thousand. It's not too bad. And there's nothing else I want here. How about you give it to the only person's inventory that has enough space for her? There we go. Alright. Kinda wish I can cast an escape spell to get out of here, but I don't believe I can. Okay, so let's light or back to anywhere but here. Sublin Town is fine. And let me take a look at my checklist to see where I can take a look at. Um, the FAQ has us going to Mistral Village and then Pity Island. Sure. Let's take a ride on Steiner. Okay, mountain range. Is that in here? No, this is Marion, if I remember right. I'm just double checking. Maybe this is Elegant? No, it looks like Marion. Yep. Definitely looks like Marion. Uh, I should try to find some topics of conversation to talk about because this part's probably going to be pretty boring to watch. Dun, 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 
dun 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 that cave we will get to later. What I want to get to is it over here? No, that's Bandor. I believe it's right here. Yep. So this is the Mistral Village. Bum 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 bum. Bum, bum. This is actually the village that we're going to get Mithril items. So for those of you that have played Shining Force 2, you know exactly what's about to happen. Uh, mithril items are generally the best items in the game. Mithril items are generally the best items in the game, and you have to do something weird in order to get some. The sailors are so handsome! I don't know how the sailors get here, given that there's a bunch of reefs nearby. Manly sailor pictures! I think it would have been so much better if Domino would have been a lady. Domino is so cool. Pity Island. We'll have to go there for plot. Um, this is for fun at the moment. Later on, we'll actually go and do more useful things here. Ah, sure. Oops, that's the exit of town. Exit of town? Apparently that's a thing now. There's a lot of weird things in this place. Like, for instance, this. Just random island. Random kid. And a lone bush. And a nice ring. That I need to go find yet another spot in my inventory for. Maybe I shouldn't have bought so many things. Wait, why do I still have the priest cane? I didn't at least get rid of that. Let me go find a shop. I think even the regular shop here has decent stuff. Hint, hint, hint. Unlike in Shining Force 2, this is not random. Beyond the Beyond is actually not as cruel as Shining Force 2 on something for the only time ever. Where did, was there actually a shop here? Ah, uh, yes, there is. Oh, I need money, don't I? It's just that nothing's labeled here, and that's part of the problem. So, do you actually have any good weapons? Uh, Dragon Scales, decent armor. Seraphic Robe is nice. Okay, so they have armor, and that's about it. Which I don't have anywhere near enough money for right now. Let's go ahead and sell off Annie's Priest's Cane. Now Annie actually has an inventory spot. Annie can go ahead and upgrade her equipment. I will go ahead and buy a Mystic Cloak, which Annie will hold on to. Item, Annie. Give to Eddie. Swap for the Wind Bandana. And the supply shop is not that great. 
as normal stuff. We have so much better than a normal supply shop at this point that there's no reason to ever go there. Right, let's actually grab the ice ring before I forget about it. Alright. Let's see, it's the ice ring has slightly less defense than the ring of defense, but you could also use it to do an ice spell. So let's see. 46. Yeah, actually, I think Edward needs it more than anybody. He's got the lowest defense at the front line, so. Uh, let's see, what else is in here? It's a cursed bandana. Where is that at? Well, I need to sell another item. No, not buy. Sell. What do I want to sell? Honestly, I can think I can buy better at this point. Was well, it this one? Yeah, I don't understand anything about how what this isn't wild arms. How beyond the beyond hides random items. It's like, seriously? Wood piles never hold anything. Neither do bushes until this part of the game. Oh, right. This is where I need to sell it at. Really, most of my money at this point of the game comes from selling cursed items, because they're valuable usually. Other than that one, apparently. Okay. And let's go ahead and... And get that. <sighs> Again, with the random items in different spots. And there's more in there, but I don't particularly feel like going in there. I instead want to get into random battles, I think. I'm really just trying to level up. Resurrect only costs 12, apparently. Not know that. Oh, apparently you actually can reach here via boat. Ah, oh, Domino finally reached 20! Hooray! Only five more levels to go! There's probably gonna be a lot of grinding this episode, isn't it? Maybe I will actually edit this episode down. Since grinding's not very interesting to look at. Edward Leach level 2! And learn Thunder 2. McWick at Leach level 2! Annie Reach level 2! And learn something. What did Annie learn? Oh, Steel! Awesome! So the steel spell um, steals MP. That, that's all it does. And it costs zero, which means Annie now has a way of restoring MP. That was the other reason why I wanted to give it to either Annie or Edward, because I believe they both get steel. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, right. Annie, how about you heal Rain us all? Wish there was a better spot to level up at. There isn't, to my knowledge. At least not right now. Oh, right, I actually need to um, use that resist tool. I should probably do that while I'm thinking about it. Resist. No? Who has it? There, Eddie has it. On Lorelei. There we go. Need to protect Lorelei against the evil sp of spells. Oh, I forgot to heal. Oh, well. It'll probably be fine. Other than Nanny getting groggy. 
That's okay, I've got resurrection now. And Annie's got a crap ton of LP to begin with. She has the highest LP in the game, if I remember right. Annie, he'll rain us all. What? Yay, Lorelai reached level 20! It's a completely worthless spell for me quite that. Same thing as attack, but air effect of your entire party. So, similar to healing rain, which is so much better than actual healing, attack 2 is so much better than actual attack. Lorelei leveled up. Oh, hey, look! Lorelei learned healing rain. But I don't think this grinding is working out very well for us, so I think we should go to a little bit more challenging place to grind, don't you? First I'm healing. It's where we're going, there ain't no heals. Never ended the game that way. That's right. We're grinding in the area that keeps killing me. Because, well, why not?
Want to see how much heal rain two heals for? Too bad you can't. I believe it heals for forty, actually. Go long. Hey look, Lorelei finally hit 25! I'll be stopping this when Domino hits 25, but that's not too much further actually. And then I'll take a screenshot of everybody's statuses so we can compare. Almost done. There we go. Done grinding! Wow, the game seems so much slower now that I'm not speeding everything up to a ridiculous amount. I also probably have crap tons of money right now. Meh. Bow down down down. Bow down. Bow. Bow down. Bow down. Ah, oh, Sir Pickwedka! Actually, wait, hold on. I want to take a look at the classes. So, keep in mind the classes that you see on these characters. So, Lorelei. or Domino is a pirate, and Lorelei is a monk. What does a pirate promote to, you might ask? Well, naturally. Promotes to a captain and wears a fancy red cloak. That way, you know, his officers won't notice if he's been stabbed. And what does Lorelei, a monk, promote to? Naturally, a master monk! And gains pigtails for some reason. I haven't figured out the pigtails part, but MMNKs are awesome. I mean, Lorelei isn't quite as awesome as um, most MMNKs, but... Oh yeah, Domino looks pretty pretty badass. Lorelai looks about the same, really. So, let's see. 
Right now, Lorelei only has three less strength than Annie, and Annie is seven levels higher. Three. That's it. Three. I mean, the attack power is off because, well, I haven't equipped Lorelei yet. In fact, why don't I go do that now? That sounds like a great idea. So I will. I can't find the equipment for Lorelei? Really? All I can find is strong leather. Oh, right, I need to clear out inventory a little bit. Uh, let's see, I don't want to sell my last guiding branch. Yeah, honestly, I'm probably never going to use it. And I can buy them now anyway. Actually, that's all I need right now. Hard leather. No, let's go strong leather. Right, we probably need to go back to Mistral Village in order to get anything better, so that's what actually what I'm going to do. Hey, Taunt. Yeah, it's totally boring without you, Taunt. Why did you hard boil yourself? Seriously. Uh, Taunt, how about you go to Mistral Village for me? Forgive my horrible humming. I don't understand why nothing's labeled in this village. Okay. Short knife is already what Domino has. Hard leather is already what Domino has. Maybe I shouldn't have sold the... Oh, I didn't even notice that I could buy a Mystic Hood here. I'm thinking I shouldn't have bothered selling the Wind Bandana, but a bit late now. Yes, that's fine. Item, Domino, Mystic Hood, give to Eddie. Changing with the Guiding Branch sounds fine. One more th set of things that I want to do. Taunt, go to everybody's favorite village. I want to take some items out of my storage trunk and use them. All of those sources that I've been saving up that I didn't know really what to do with, I want to use them all. There's no reason not to at this point. And I'm going to have to deposit an item first so I can... Let's see, how many things am I going to want to withdraw? Uh, let's see... What, oh, did I finally get them all out already? Ah, oh, I must have. So I don't see any. Well, that was a waste of time. Source of Courage is the only source I have on me, so I guess I'm going to use it. Ah, itchy nose. Uh, source of Courage was the one that increased strength. Who needs the biggest increase in strength? I mean, quite cooking more strength is always nice. But to be honest, I think Domino needs it the most. Use Domino! Oh, that's right, it was a standard level up. Crap. Oh, that was a waste. Oh well. My fault. Bit late now, and I'm not going to reload for something like that, especially since I haven't saved stated in a while, I think. Let me double check that. 
Ah, that's actually off the side of the screen. There we go. Oops, sorry. How far back was my save state? I don't feel like grinding them again. Oh well! <laughs> Bit late now. So, next time I will hopefully do something that's actually relevant. Woo! Uh, yeah, we need to go to Pity next time. Ah, uh, Pity Foo. Pity Island, yep. And Pity Island is easiest to reach from Bandor, actually, so. Taunt, you're going to Bandor, and so are we. I'll stop when I reach Bandor. Which, to be honest, doesn't exactly take long. Hooray, teleportation! Bye.